Hi, my name is Taylor Martino, and I'm a graduate student in the chemistry department at Western University. Um, I came to Western for my graduate degree mostly because I did my undergrad at Western and I loved the department and I was really comfortable and it had a lot of great profs to, to work with. Uh, the prof that I really wanted to work with accepted me right away. Um, so it was a really easy decision to stay at Western. He showed me the lab and he let me meet all my future lab mates and uh, research associates and it was just a really, I got a really good feeling about it. So I joined Western for my graduate degree as well. So my lab deals with problems of corrosion. So my project specifically deals with what to do with nuclear waste bundles once they're done in the reactor. So the plan for Canada um, is to put them in specially designed canisters and the outside of this canister is copper. Now this is a good material because it won't corrode uh, underground in the presence of water. But our uh, groundwater has things in it, such as sulfide, that can uh, corrode the copper. So we need to find out what the mechanism is of this corrosion, under what conditions it occurs, so we can tell uh, the nuclear waste disposal for Canada uh, under what conditions it's safe to bury them and where it wouldn't be safe. The best thing about the uh, chemistry program is just the ability that you have to work with uh, other labs and other uh, and other different departments on campus. So if I have a problem that I can't quite solve using the tools that I have in my lab, if someone, say down the hall, can run an experiment in their lab that can help me, everyone is very willing to help each other out. Uh, being in corrosion, it's a very interdisciplinary study as well. So we used uh, Western uh, facilities such as Service Science Western, uh, Biotron Imaging Facility, and Nanofab Western. Uh, we also partner, uh, we have contacts in physics and engineering. So there's a lot of places uh, at Western to answer the questions that you need to solve in your research. The best piece of advice I could give to someone applying to chemistry is come in and meet the supervisor and talk about the project that you're going to be working with. If you're really interested in the topic at hand, then coming in every day and running experiments and running into problems, you'll really be focused on solving them. And meet your lab mates, meet your research associates, meet the people that you're going to be working with. Because if you come in every day and you love your research and you love the people that you're working with, it just it makes grad school a really good experience.